He assaults me. He assaults me. He assaults me. Yeah, I will. I will. What the actual fuck? What the actual fuck? What the actual fuck? What the actual fuck? I said call 911, you're harassing me. You are the one who fucking physically assaulted me. You? Call 911, you're harassing me. What are you talking about? You hit my friend in the fucking face. I've never touched your friend. What's your name? I never touched your friend. You're harassing me. There's fucking cameras here. 100%, then they'll see you're a complete liar. Look at the camera. Is your friend a liar? No, because that's how young you are. Just my fucking friend. I didn't touch your friend. It's all on camera. She's harassing me. Crazy white chick. <laughs> This security video given to NBC4 by Jennifer's attorney appears to show a man striking a woman through an open window on the driver's side of a car, then walking away with children in tow. A woman runs after him. Jennifer says that's her in the surveillance. He assaults me. And this is her cell phone video. With her mouth bloodied, she and Regan confront him. You hit my friend in the face. I've never touched What's your, your friend. What's your name? I never touched your friend. You're harassing here. me. Good evening, everyone. I'm Colleen Williams. And I'm Carolyn Johnson. Chuck has the night off. Let's get right to NBC4's Robert Kovacic, live in Pico Robertson with the story for us. Robert. Carolyn and Colleen, the LAPD confirms a police report was filed after what happened near where I'm standing last Wednesday. But tonight, Jennifer Chen and her attorney are demanding elevated charges and an arrest, detailing their reasons why. He punched me in my face and spit out racial slurs like Asian. 30-year-old Jennifer Chen says she has no doubt what happened to her. It is a hate crime. What the actual And that's why she did not stay silent. I said call 911 to harass me. The soon-to-be doctor visiting from Toronto with her friend Regan picking up her godson at school in Pico Robertson. They say they were followed in by a driver honking. We turned into the garage and he was still laying on his horn. Regan got out to go get her son and asked the man in his parked car with children inside. What's your problem? Is there a problem? This security video given to NBC4 by Jennifer's attorney appears to show a man striking a woman through an open window on the driver's side of a car, then walking away with children in tow. A woman runs after him. Jennifer says that's her in the surveillance. He assaults me. And this is her cell phone video. With her mouth bloodied, she and Regan confront him. You hit my friend in the face. I've never touched What's your, your friend. What's your name? I never touched your friend. You're harassing here. me. There are um, criminal as well as civil aspects of this case, and we strongly believe that this type of conduct um, just should not go unpunished. Jennifer has her own message. I hope your kids don't grow up like you. The LAPD says at this point, this case is considered a misdemeanor battery. Carolyn, we also want to point out that NBC4 has tried numerous times to reach out to the man in question here, but we have not yet been able to locate him. Live in Pico Robertson, I'm Robert Kavasic. Let's go back to you.